know that every time you're away, I long for you so much I can find my way. We got everything here. So we left Vegas this morning, finally, after 10 or so very productive days where we got a lot of stuff done. And if you want to know more about that, you just watch this video right up here because uh, we break it down, all the stuff we got done. We didn't get a lot done. Yeah, we did. But we left Vegas, which means we were pulling out of Nevada. We drove a little bit through Arizona, through a cool canyon. And um, now we're where? I got a haircut. Kurt got a haircut. That's why we were in Vegas, where we got so much done. Right our way to Zion Canyon, we're at a... Um... Zion National Park. Yeah. And we are parked on some government land just outside of it. We saw an incredible sunset, so we're going to show you that right now. Right as we were pulling in. Then it got dark on us quick, so we're eating. We're going to get up and get a fresh start in the morning at Zion. See you all in the morning. Guys, we're pretty stoked. We're in the Grand Canyon area, and so we just want to give you an idea of what we're thinking. It's, it's all, everything, all our travels are subject to change. But right now we're in Zion National Park. So we're gonna come through Zion, we're gonna turn up. We may hit these little coral pink sand dunes, but then we're gonna turn up and hit Bryce Canyon. We're gonna do the Grand Staircase, Capitol Reef. We're gonna come across and do natural bridges. We're gonna skip the arches and canyonlands because we've done that before. And then we're gonna come down here and we're gonna do the Grand Canyon, the South Rim. The South yeah. Rim. And I, I think up in here also is the Antelope Canyon. So yeah. we want to do those. So we'll do that. And then we're going to end up in Flagstaff. So so what's that lake right there, Kurt? That is Lake, lake Powell. Oh, Lake Powell. Yeah. You right here. And I swear that we got nothing to fear. It's a miracle that you and I find. This is a little clip for my cousin Michelle because we are at a place where me and her have childhood memories and it's not Hopi Point at the Grand Canyon not yet that's coming up next Michelle but I'm at Zion how many times do we play on the switchbacks here I'm too old to go to them now so this is the best you're gonna get Wow, look at that. <laughs> Holy cow, out of nowhere. 
That is amazing. Look at those columns. They're called hoodoos. Hoodoos. Look at those hoodoos. <laughs> <laughs> that is absolutely gorgeous, guys. Wow. I just want to feel alive. It's just what I do when I'm out. So try not to hold me down. Feel alive. drive a faster car i'm gonna be myself i'm gonna be someone else i'm gonna be myself i'm gonna be someone else i'm gonna skip my breaks i'm gonna make mistakes i'm gonna skip my breaks i'm gonna make mistakes i'm gonna be myself i'm gonna be someone else i'm gonna be myself i'm gonna be someone else I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes. I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes. Alright guys, so I'm about to go on a hike. Just to let you guys know, I'm here at Bryce Canyon. And somewhere, I gotta find the trail. But I'm gonna go down there to the bottom of that area right there. So I don't know what the elevation change is. But uh, I'm going for a walk. And I think there's a trail right over there. So guys, the Navajo Loop, 1.3 miles round trip. Here we go. So my assumption is, is I'm going down there. But look at this, guys. So cool. Just amazing. Guys, look at this thing. A little hole in the side of the rocks. I don't need to see it, but I was just right up there. I feel like this is something out of a movie set, guys. The way the light's bouncing off of this, the trees and the rocks, and these trees right in the middle of this. All these rocks just growing right out of the rock. So different, so different than the rainforests in Washington and the hike to Bagby Springs. Such a contrast. But I... So if you guys are wondering why all of a sudden I got down in here in this little cavern, there's all these trees 
is right now I'm standing in a dry riverbed. So you can kind of see where it's eroded up there. Ugh. So guys, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. So if I go up to the left, it's six tenths of a mile back to where I started. If I go to the right, the Queen's Garden Trail, it's 1.6 miles. So what that tells me is this is gonna be steeper and shorter than the one on the left, and the one on the right is probably gonna be gradual for a while before it takes off. But I think I'm gonna go the longer trail because I'm never gonna be here again. But I came around this corner right here and stopped me dead in my tracks. I didn't expect this, but I'm gonna be walking through a little slot. Look at that. So it's clearer in the sky, but it's still definitely a cool little feature. I always like to see when you pop out of these one of these things, what it looks like on the other side. I was thinking either I'm getting in better shape or this trail's easier. I chose to think I'm getting in better shape, but I still have eight tenths of a mile to go. But look at this. And like I said, whenever I come through these things, I always like to see what's on the other side. And this one, my friend, did not disappoint. So guys, it's official. I made it back to the van. But on my way back, I learned some bad news. So I'm gonna show you guys when I get back. So guys, I don't know if you can see that, but my spin down filter broke. And so last night it got down to about 20 degrees. And so I think that plastic got cold and brittle. And when I turned the pump on this morning, I think it shattered it. So I don't have a backup, so I'm gonna have to bypass that filter. I've got the pipe to fix that. So I'm gonna have to bypass that till I can get me another spin down filter.
If you like this video, go ahead and hit the thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to our channel so you know when we put up future videos. And if you want to help support our videos by keeping fuel in the tank and the van wheels turning, check out our Patreon page where you can see behind the scenes action. Thanks for tuning in and we'll see you guys in a few days.